Hey guys, I'm going to do a tutorial of one of my favorite crafting projects. It's a little beaded pony bead lizard. And um, this is a pattern for it. I've looked it up online. You can find this pretty easy. That's the pattern I have printed out and I will attach that in the comments to the video. These are really fun to make, pretty addictive. Once you get started making them, you can look up all kinds of different patterns for different animals to make and um, kind of have a blast with these. So this is how you get it started. You have a, a little keychain loop. You take your string. This is uh, sort of a nylon cord. You could also use silk cord, anything like that. Yarn wouldn't work, but anything that's a little bit stronger than that should be fine. Pull it through to make a loop like this. And then you are ready to start. I'm gonna tape this down, it makes it easier to work with. I've already pre-counted out the beads that I need. I have 27 of my primary color, 21 of my secondary color, and then two black beads for the eyes. So we're gonna start with our primary color. You stick the bead through one side, and then you take the string and stick it through other one, the opposite direction, until you pull the bead all the way up to the top. So one bead on to begin with, and then two. Stick it through the opposite side. nice and flat. Try to get them together as close as you can. The next row is going to have our eyes, so we need black, our primary color, and then another black, so there'll be three beads. Stick it through. to the top. Then you have the start of the face. You can see the little eyes right there. One more row of two. Now we're going to start the row that has the little legs on it. So for that one, you're gonna string all the beads that you need for the legs on to one string. So that's two of your primary color, three of your secondary color, and then pull it all the way up to the top. And then you're just gonna stick the same string that they're on just back through the last two of the primary color. Try to hold that nice and tight in place. And you've got one little leg. Pull it nice and tight. And then do the same thing on the other side. Two of your primary, then three of the secondary. Keep it nice and close to the body. Stick that through those two. And then that is your second little leg. Now we're gonna keep on going with the little body. So the next row is one primary, and then we're gonna start bringing in our secondary color. And then one more, so you got three. primary and then the 
this time we're going to go to secondary color. back down to just three beads. little back set of legs. So it's going to be the same thing. We're going to put all five beads on, two of the primary and three of the secondary. So I just pushed it back a little closer to the body. Kids love making these. They will make these all day they get the hang of it. And then just two more to finish off the little back of his body of our primary color. Sometimes the little beads pop up a little bit, but you can just kind of smash them back down. And then now we're just going to finish off the tail by doing one bead every other color. If the legs are too difficult and you don't want to mess with those, you can always just turn this same pattern into a snake. Just don't add the legs and make the body a little bit longer. As you finish this off, just kind of stretch it out a little bit, make sure the beads are nice and flat. And then once you finish it, you want to tie it off at the bottom. 
I like to put a little bit of glue on the knot to keep it from coming undone. So once you do that, you can just dab a little bit of glue. Any kind of glue you have should work just to keep it from unraveling. And then there you have it. Cute little beaded lizard. Thanks for watching.